Yo guys, what's up? And welcome back to Whoa, that's upside down. To another YouTube video. Today in this YouTube video, I'm gonna be showing you guys something pretty cool. Now, if you guys notice, I'm actually on a different platform. I have a lamp right here. Nothing else though. So this will what the heck is that? Ugh. This is where I will be recording just my non-coin rule hunting videos because it looks much more better. If I would say so myself. But anyways, let's get right on to the video. Alrighty guys. So if I open this up, you will see the word uncirculated. But uncirculated what? I will not let you guys see. I'm kidding. As you guys see, it is a 19 7 30. Two through them. No. Okay, it is a uncirculated half dollar. It is very, very, very cool. So you guys can see right here the half dollar. Isn't that cool? I thought it was pretty cool. But, anyways, uh, I got this for my birthday. My grandparents gave it to me. Let's bring it up for you guys. Light just a tad. As you guys can see, United States of America, it is indeed a commemorative half dollar. It was made in 1982, which is pretty cool. And so if I open it up here, as you guys can see, it says the George, the George Washington Silver Commemorative Half Dollar coin is being one of Fred in recognition of the 250th 50th anniversary of the birth of George Washington. Size 1.205 in diameter. Um, rigid edge, which means it has uh, these uh, that thing, those things, those little spikes. Um, weight it is point four zero one nine troy ounces composition which means what is in it point three six one seven fine troy ounce of silver and point zero four zero two troy ounce of copper it is also in the finest it is point nine zero zero silver and point one zero zero copper, which means it is ninety nine percent copper. Um, the designer is Elizabeth Jones, chief speculator and engraver of the United States Mint Mark D. Public Law, the Authority Public Law, ninety seven through 104 December 23rd 1981 Mint United States Mint Denver Colorado and I actually live near there which is pretty cool and I did not get this near there ha huh. I actually got some Missouri that's where my grandparents live isn't that weird that's pretty weird um I thought it was pretty cool though you guys can pause it and read the back I'll just give a couple of seconds Alrighty guys, now that that couple seconds is over, I have a little secret in this thing right here. Now as you guys can see, United States Mint, it is a lot thicker than this is. And it can hold this, which is why I hit a little secret in here. So if you open this up and take this out, right there, can you see that? Just the very edge of a coin. Now, what kind of coin is that exactly? I don't know. Let's just see. Uh, looks like you guys are just going to see until the next video. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you didn't already, please go down, comment, like, and feel free to subscribe. And I just want you guys all to know that I am just kidding about this. Um, the coin is indeed my very, very, very cool 1909 plain date penny. She's in very, very, very good condition. 
absolutely love this coin. But right here, there is another one. Not only that, just to put the coin in, as you guys can see, I can slide it in just like so. And it goes perfect. Now, that right there, I, uh, hold on. Let me take it and just give it a couple bangs. Make sure. All right, now let me get it out really, really, really quickly, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, as you guys can see, it is my fingers. Wow. No, it is actually a three cent coin from 1865. Now, if you guys do not actually believe that this is real, well, guess what? It is. They also made two cent coins and half pennies, which is very, very cool. I actually have one from a different country, a half penny. But if you turn it, oh, wow, that was crazy. Is it double headed? Yes, because it's fake. No, it's not. Um, I just turned it over a little bit too fast. And look, as you guys can see, the double uh, eyes equals three, which means it is indeed a three cent coin. Isn't that pretty cool? I, th I thought it was. All right, so that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you didn't, guys, go down, comment, like, and feel free to subscribe. And if you didn't already, um, th thank you guys so much for watching. Happy hunting. Peace, guys. Bye-bye.